if you missed out on Ordi and Sats and the other new Bitcoin Meta Protocol based tokens, then you should watch this video till the end. Not only that, we're going to discuss the most innovative and important new token on Bitcoin at the moment, which is referred to as TAP DMT NAT. I'm also going to show you guys another airdrop that's upcoming, which you can take advantage of. Welcome to Crypto University. My name is Gray BTC. And on behalf of the Crypto University team, I would appreciate it if you can subscribe to this channel and like the video because we have been on top of the game bringing you guys blockchain, especially Bitcoin related content from the beginning. We did SATs from the beginning. We minted it. We helped you guys get into already at the beginning. So if you appreciate things like that, definitely smash the like button. So straight to the point here, tap DMT NAT. What the hell is this token? Okay, so some of you probably already know this. I will assume though that you're watching this video for the first time and you have no idea what's going on in the Bitcoin ecosystem. So I'll walk you through it a little bit. What's happening is that in the Bitcoin ecosystem, there are what we call meta protocols. If you're familiar with Ethereum, we have what we call layer two chains. Like these are blockchains that basically work in correspondent with Ethereum. They're a little bit much faster, but they commit to the Ethereum blockchain at the end. So a little bit similar in the Bitcoin ecosystem is happening and we're calling these meta protocols. Some of them are outright layer twos, but these meta protocols basically run directly on Bitcoin. But think of them as layer two or separate layers just for simplification. So there are several uh, type of meta protocols. There's Pipe, there is Atomicos, there's CBRC20, there's TAP, and there's Ordinos, which you guys already know. Ordinos is popular with tokens like SATs, Ordi, and so on and so forth. And then recently we got uh, within the TAP meta protocol, we have a new token called DMT NAT. DMT stands for Digital Matter Theory, and NAT means non arbitrary tokens. Okay, what this means is basically what well, we can just look into it. But as we stand, this token currently has a market cap of less than $30 million at the moment, as we speak. It launched just about over a week ago, and so far it has consumed a lot of Bitcoin with pretty much total, total volume in Bitcoin. 113 Bitcoins have been traded, which is a total of $4.5 million. And currently it's looking at 24 hour volume of 162,000. So just like when we found Ordi at the beginning, guys, if you remember, it seemed like nothing was going on. The numbers were so small, but it was because it was too early. So this, I believe, is the same. But I don't want to talk about the token, the price, and how to buy it without talking about what the hell is this Is this thing? Like, what does it mean? So there is a good article here which was written about on an arbitrary tokens, and we can basically just go through that, and that might help explain things for you guys a little bit on coin live so the block element table opens up a new channel for discovering bitcoins native digital assets this is a new continent that is equivalent to smart contracts returning from smart contracts i mean following the idea of code is low to block elements following block as a ledger or block as ledger which is more in line with the minimalist spirit of bitcoin Okay, so what these guys are trying to explain here is to say that in matter, in the real world, right, we look at the periodic table to find specific elements that we're looking for. So, you know, scientists use these tables to search for new substances such as semiconductor materials and so on and so forth. And there is now a belief that the digital world will have much more matter eventually than the real world. I mean, because it keeps on growing, right? 
and it's its own world and basically it doesn't consume any sort of physical space. And this is the proposition that we can sort of create a periodic table-like method within Bitcoin's data, which means a certain amount of matter can exist based on a specific set of conditions. That's why we call these non-arbitrary tokens, right? The first non-arbitrary based digital asset, we could say, within this ecosystem has been, has been the Bitcoin land, which we refer to as, can you guess? Bitmap. Bitmap basically exists only when a block on the Bitcoin blockchain has been processed and it creates a piece of land within the Bitmap metaverse. And this land is subdivided by the amount of transactions that are within the block. So the transaction data dictates how many subdivisions should be per given Bitmap data. So that's Bitmap. But there was no token. So DMT is creating a unified, non-arbitrary digital world. Keep in mind, the people behind DMT are the same people behind Bitmap. From the official DMT white paper, it can be seen that the DMT proposed by the founder of Bitmap just integrates these new but independent digital asset issuance protocols. That's all he knows, BRC20, Bitmap, BRC420 from a higher dimension of theory and narrative to summarize and improve chemical elements constitutes the real world and block elements will consi constitute the digital world opening the door to a non-binary digital material world based on bitcoin and block elements corresponding to the physical material world and generating quantum entanglement dmt we are uniting to create a non-arbitrarily digital world, not a specific project, but a new ecology, a new narrative, the ultimate form of digital civilization built on the blockchain. Everyone is working together to create a true metaverse. We dream the ultimate digital in the world is about to unify. Okay, so this is what they're basically trying to explain here that there's so many protocols right now and they need to be an all-in, uh, sort of a, a token that encompasses all of them, whether it's uh, BRC20 or 420 and so on and so forth. Now, another important element to understand here, since we're talking about non arbitrary tokens, it's this concept of the block number. So if you own, so they gave an example of a Bitcoin block. This is block... 817,824 block. This block has a bunch of data around it. This is the block data. So the transaction count of this block creates a bitmap. However, the bit size, because it's also amounted to some sort of bits, right? Bits are the smallest form of digital data. And this bit is equal to the amount of NAT that will be created from this block. So for every block that is fully processed on, on the Bitcoin network, a new amount of NATs will be added to the ecosystem. And that is going to be corresponding to the amount of bits within that block. Or whatever the, the bit size of that block is equal to the amount of NATs that will come from there. So if you're on block 817824, using the NAT, using the NAT mint inscription, you own 386 million NATs, basically. So, you know, it sounds like it's too out there, guys, but this is an impressive improvement within the Bitcoin Meta Protocol ecosystem. And you should read up on your own. I will make another video at some point. But I just wanted to make sure that I have covered this early enough so that you guys don't miss out. Now, how do you buy this token? The biggest supporter of this have been audionoswallet.com. So if you have your Xverse wallet and stuff like that, you can definitely connect and buy some. The token is being sold in basically batches on this market, right? So you can buy like 1 billion 
NATs at once, which will cost you $119 and so on and so forth. But you can buy here and put it into your Express wallet or your Unisat wallet. Basically how we have been buying any sort of inscriptions before. If you don't know how to do that, I have created several videos on this channel to cover that. And then we also have SuperX. This is a newer on-chain exchange that's coming soon and it's growing and it's charting even BRC20 tokens out here. So this is where you can sort of see the chart for this token. I'm um, looking at DMT NAT against USDT. Currently the price is 0 0.0005, you know, so you know that we're getting this at the very, very beginning. All right, but you can also, there is an airdrop that these guys are working on. So if you go on Super X, well, before I tell you about the airdrop, let's give out a shout out to our sponsor actually, which is CoinW guys. If you want to trade cryptocurrency at an efficient exchange, that is fast, has a lot of liquidity, and doesn't ask you for KYC like crazy, CoinW is the only place you can go. Not only they support this channel, they also support you by giving you low fees, allowing you to copy trade, and making your life easier by listing ETFs. So you can trade crypto ETFs on, on CoinW, and if you sign up using our link in the description below, you will get very, very low fees, and you will get something special than that. You will be part of the crypto university community. So if we launch our copy trading on this platform, you will be able to copy our trades and also a lot of benefits that come from you signing up using our referral link. And you're also supporting the channel. So get an account on CoinW and start trading. And I will be sharing some of my trades also on here so that you guys can follow. Okay, back to the subject. So when you go to SuperX, they literally are promoting their uh, a potential airdrop that might happen here. We just scroll down to find where that is. Okay, activities. Where is that? Space. Uh, yeah, if you go to Task Center, they have things that you have to do and you do stand a chance of getting an airdrop if you complete those tasks. They haven't launched their token, but it looks like it's coming. So what you can do is to basically just follow what they ask you on this platform. You can trade spot and futures. Currently, they don't have any token. So you have to make sure to get involved so that when they launch their airdrop, when their airdrop basically takes place, you are part of those people that will be able to get it. Okay. So they have different type of rewards here, but they also have, I'm looking for the airdrop part. Where is that? This is SCS airdrop. This is where you find it. So they'll create their own token called the SCS token. And you can currently start earning this token by airdrop. So the moment you you deposit on their, on SuperX, you get two tokens. When you start trading futures, you get two when you trade, you get two. And when you refer a friend, you get two. And if you invite a friend to trade, you all, you get five tokens. You recommend a friend to trade more, you get 10 more tokens. So maybe I should actually just create my own link also and share it with you guys because, I mean, why not? Seems like there's a lot of rewards. So if you're going to get on this platform to start hunting for this airdrop, for sure, make sure you use our link as well because guys it goes a long way you support the channel and it's always fantastic to see and it's listing a lot of so i'm just trying to check if this token is actually does it exist already or it's really an airdrop okay so they have an s chain so the scs chain is live they also have mainnet explorer here and all that so i think the scs token will be the official utility token for SuperX, from what I can tell you. I haven't really doubled much with this platform, so I just discovered it recently. But I wanted to share it with you guys first, as always. Okay, so another platform you can use to explore tokens and the volumes and the activity, you can always use satsx.io. I like to use this platform now to sort of explore. Some of you ask in the alpha group, well, you minted board with me and some other tokens. 
on CBRC20, but you're like, okay, where do we sell these tokens? So or what are the prices? How are things going? You can always go to satx.io and we have all the meta protocols here. Then you can check how things are basically performing. All right. I will make a specific video on this, but I know a lot of us minted data, token, Pepe, Degen, and all that stuff. And they do, you know, they're sort of buying in the market now. We're just waiting for the right time for them to explode. Junk, if you remember junk, we minted together junk as well. And it's live in the market price, in the marketplace with a floor price of $1 per 420 junk tokens. All right. So I just wanted to share DMT NAT with you guys. I think this is going to be massive from what I can tell and also what a lot of other people that I know in this ecosystem are telling me. So please do not sleep on it and never say that we didn't tell you. I'll see you on the next video. Subscribe to the channel and see you later. Cheers, guys.